Questions and comments? The member from the PN, Carl. Thank you very much, Speaker. It's my pleasure, obviously, to, uh, to join in debate today uh, for Bill 68, Modernizing Ontario's Municipal Legislation Act. I'm very pleased, obviously, to follow our critic uh, and my friend and mentor, um, from the member from Oxford. Uh, he has been, uh, obviously, doing this particular work um, as critic for municipal affairs for many years, uh, in and out of this critic portfolio, so he does have a profound understanding. He also came to this legislature um, after he arrived here, I think, 20 years ago, uh, with a, a substantial background in municipal politics. So I, I think I'll take what he says, opposed to what the minister says, um, seriously when he talks about uh, when he talks about downloading, when he talks uh, about consultation, when he talks about the frustration from stakeholders. Uh, I'll take his word for it. Uh, one thing that he did talk about, he did talk a little bit about energy and he did talk a little bit about people's bills. And there was one thing, Speaker, that I think we need to talk about. It affects everyone here. It affects our municipalities. And, and it was when he said after all the bills were paid, this one individual that he knows could only fo afford a loaf of bread. And, Speaker, you're well aware of my work over the past a decade, 11 years actually, uh, with food cupboards in my con constituency of Nepean Carlton. I've raised tens of thousands of pounds of food. This year, uh, in particular, I'm very, very concerned. Um, not only are the high price of hydro impacting people's ability to put food on the table, but last week our Christmas parade in, Bar in Barhaven was cancelled due to very bad weather, very high winds, and it was actually a food drive for the Barhaven food cupboard. And I was just notified that they're in a crisis situation. So 220 families uh, in Barhaven rely on this food cupboard. And, Speaker, in our municipality, in the great city of Ottawa, that is quite serious. And so uh, I'll be doing a breakfast this Saturday to try and get some food in there. But you know something, Speaker? It's getting tougher and tougher and tougher. And oftentimes it's our municipalities who are on the front lines of those challenges. Thank you.